Yeah, I think I had really good legs today, actually. It was a surprise. I didn't, I didn't have very good, didn't feel great for the time trial. And then, so I wasn't really sure what to expect for the road race. Um, I felt really good, actually. Yeah, yeah, really good. Um, road racing isn't quantifiable as such. So there were times in the race, you know, I think we'd done four laps and the gold medal was well up the road. And, the car and, then, and there was five or six of us chasing um and that wasn't a great scenario at all so to be sat here with a silver medal afterwards um yeah um, I'm, I'm really pleased yeah i mean and overall you've had like a you've had a great game loads of medals to take home what's your how do you feel about your overall performance yeah i couldn't have dreamed for better really i'm, I'm definitely consistent <laughs> training for three events is uh, is really difficult training for an event that lasts three and a half minutes for, to one that lasts for two nearly two and a half hours um I couldn't be I couldn't be happier yeah it's really good and I don't you know I don't know about Paris yet um after after straight straight afterwards I said this is it I'm never racing again um some in order I think one of the coping strategies I had for the extra year is that I said this is where I would stop it almost allowed me to see have a line in the sand and be like I'm going to stop here so then I could really give 100 percent for an extra year um and I think it's worked because I've obviously given a hundred percent here and I've been able to do that this morning I woke up and and did say to myself this is the last time I'm gonna do this and then when I was in the race and we went up the climb for the last time I said to myself this is the last time I have to go this deep I have to suffer this much so that was almost what allowed me to I guess dig that deep 